For years in the past, computer cases were either really ugly or were trying to look cool but instead looked even uglier. The NZXT S340 Elite may be the best looking case with some tricks up its sleeve. This is my review of it. Before we get into the video, I've made various videos on my PC so if you want to check those out, you can find them down below or just visit my channel. The S340 Elite is a mid-tower case composed of steel and tempered glass with cable management bars and cutouts, support for a 280-280mm cooler, integrated power supply shroud, 3 SSD mounts, and filters in the front and bottom which are easy to remove. It supports mini ATX, micro ATX, and ATX motherboards. It weighs 8.13 kilograms, and there's a ton of information on screen you can pause the video if you like. Link to the info is down below. I believe this is one of the best looking cases out there because it's not over the top and it can really fit in anyone's setup. There are a couple of color options to choose from. I have the white one here, as you can see it also has some black on it which I love. This is probably my favorite color combo. Mine has the CyberPower PC branding inside and on the front because that's where I bought my PC. If you buy the case alone, it will not have that. If you're planning on building a PC and have a budget for a case like this, I would definitely recommend this one because it's spacious and it has many cutouts as well as a bar for cable management. That's usually the part that gets people frustrated and making it easier is always best. You have support for 140mm fans all around but you could also use 120mm if you like. There are three SSD mounts and they're all visible through the tempered glass. I don't have any SSDs at the moment because I was trying to cut the cost since I was on a budget when I bought it, but I'll definitely add some soon because the PC still looks empty and SSDs really make a huge difference. I did add two 140mm fans in the front as intake and they work well. You may think that with the front panel pretty much blocking the, the entire front of the case, there's no way air enters or leaves the case through there, but it still works. There's room on top and bottom where the air can enter or exit. My PC stays cool even when gaming for hours, so I'd say it works pretty well. I have the Corsair ML140 Pro in the front, so that may be why. One thing that can be a little tricky is removing the front panel to add a fan or something. All you have to do is remove both side panels and remove the front panel gently but with force. At first I got scared because the sound of it coming off was not good, but it sounds like that. And it's easy to put back, just align all the cutouts and snap it together. As you saw, there is a filter in the front so dust doesn't enter the case if you have the intake fans in the front. It's nice of them to add that because they are really helpful and keep your components clean. You can also find a filter on the bottom. The legs on this case are also a bit more elevated than some other cases, which is good for maximum airflow. And I think it looks good that way. On top of the case you have some USB ports, HDMI port, a headphone and microphone jack. This case is VR ready by the way, whatever that means. On the back, there's room for a ton of ports which depends on your motherboard of course. Mine didn't come with the NZXT Puck, but I bought it separately and it works flawlessly on this case. So if you're getting the case, get the Puck too if it doesn't come with it already. This case is just beautiful, it doesn't look too flashy or too gamer looking. Anyone who would have the option to own this case, I'm sure would say yes to it. I also have an LED strip inside on the bottom. It's not the best position for it, but I like it. Just know that lighting will look incredible in here. So obviously this is one of my favorite cases on the market and for the premium price tag of $100, I think it's totally worth it. If you want a high-end, mid-tower case, this is the one. As always, thanks for watching and most importantly, have a great day.